clear of the closing doors, please. They say this is the greatest city on earth, but is this really? You can start with nothing and end with everything, and vice versa, clearly. Five boroughs separate us, each with a culture of its own. It's life of the poor and rich, it's life of the healthy and the sick. How can we ever be bored? This is the city. Money can be made, and talents hold weight. But can you find love? Maybe love for yourself? No one in the world can have every culture in the world. No place but NYC where it's at, you already know. You probably got so take three, get your three fingers at one time. Trying to be on the goon shit. Everyone here trying to be a goon. Not everyone want to be a goon. Check it out, check it out. I spent a lot of my time. I like the people. Yeah, guys, I'm all over the world. I just think it's boring. <laughs> I think I was meant to be a different world. This one made me. Like you from growing up as a kid, like you couldn't be so. Like. Bodies like flowers get put in the dirt. Ripping the vault till they kicking my dots on the sofa now. People, people about that, not right now. It's quite people, very nice people. You got some of the most independent, sexy females you ever seen in your life in New York, man. Well, I've dated a lot of girls. <laughs> I can just like walk downstairs and like go to the corner store. Yo, big wheel. If I need to go to the mall or the city, I could just take the train. Are you serious? It's like, always a uh, it's, always a it's like 40 minutes to go four miles. Harlem just be like, are they flashy? <laughs> you can't call Harlem. Harlem is part of, it's, it's part of, it's part of Manhattan. Anyone show a all of them is where it's at, man. Yeah, like, this where it's at, man. We the father to every borough. Oh, <laughs> Came up out the dirt, now the grass a little greener. A lot of people doubted me, I make them more believers. I'm trying to go from puppy trains to pulling up in Beamers. I moved here because I went to grad school here. I've always wanted to live here. Actually, I feel like I grew up here. It's almost like boot camp. It, like, you have like X amount of time and there's like infinite amount of things to do. It really forces you to like focus and like figure out like where you want to spend your hours. Right here in Manhattan, you already know. When you want to party, have fun, come here, and just chill. La Marina, Dykeman. Start conversation with me. 
but when I'm walking, like trying to go somewhere, I don't want to be like hollered at and hooted at. And but that's another thing about being a New York girl is like it's okay. He can step away. I'll be okay. This is I understand all the like a lot of people hate, hate on them. But like my old roommate is in the police department. And like he's a good guy. He tells me stories like how like the pressure it is to like decision at like certain points. Yeah, so a lot of them are fucked up, but there's a lot of good ones too. Brooklyn is like everyone wanna be a hipster. Everyone there trying to be RC or some type of next thing. Mad rat with the water, nigga. That's who I am, mad rat. <laughs> Something about people from Brooklyn, it just. We have tough skin. I like the prettiness of Brooklyn, man. 10 hours, bro. 10 hours, bro. Except. Like they're the bougiest ever. No lie, no lie. Y'all be acting bougie. Even though y'all got the app and a far walk away, and then anytime y'all say the 40, that's the worst part. Carry that New York swagger, but without that chip on your shoulder. I believe if my race don't slay me, then the Lord gonna do it. Pain is distributed, so I know we all going through it. From uh, Queens Village, New right York. Here. Shady hey. Road is where I'm at. It's my block. Queens doesn't actually get the greatest rep all the time. Not that it's a bad place. Got Hollis Deli. It just doesn't get the recognition that Brooklyn or Manhattan or even the Bronx gets. You got the best food, the best people, different cultures, different ethnicities. Come to Danny's Pizza. All right. Really good. Really good. Really good. You got that Papa John's or Franny Lou. The best of both worlds in Queens, I think, because you get a little bit of the hustle and bustle. But you get the suburban feel. People are so um, rude. Like, we don't have as much southern hospitality or like manners as other people like, I'm not gonna sit here and fight with you. Like my friend came from PA like just last weekend and she was just like everybody's here is in a rush. For the most part Staten Island is just another world to us. We're underrated. You know what I'm saying? We're known we're known as the forgotten bubble. Every event I ever went to they shot at every borough, except for Staten Island. Don't get a we, I need the mic to leave this place. I feel the There's a lot of ball. shit that goes on in Staten Island that people don't even know about. That day, he wasn't even selling cigarettes. All of other numbers. Like the drug epidemic. I lost a lot of my friends to heroin and drugs. Like, Wu Tang Clan is the best rap group that ever come out in hip hop. Word. And that shit started in Staten Island. There's five boroughs of death right there, you know mm. what I'm saying? Like. Yo, you can't leave Staten Island out. It's very hard to talk to them. Like, I gotta come up to them with like my 700 likes on my chest and then they'll talk to me. <laughs> Be a girl that, you know, I can feel something with. If it happens, it happens, you know what I mean?